Hello students, welcome back. In this video, we will continue chapter number 14 that is communication. Before moving further, let me ask some questions related to the previous video and I hope you know the answers very well. So first is, what is communication? Second, who invented printing machine? Third, who introduced postal service? Fourth, what made communication easier and simpler? Fifth, what is personal communication? Sixth, name some services provided by post office. Seventh, what is telegraph? Eighth, what is Morse code? The objectives of today's video are to know about the fastest means of communication, to make you familiar with more means of personal communication, to give you information about abbreviations like STD, ISD, SMS, QMS, PIN, PCO, WWW, etc. How does a fax machine work? How can we send an email? In the previous video, we have discussed meaning of communication, types of communication. They are personal communication and mass communication. First, we have discussed meaning and means of personal communication. Under this, we have already discussed post office and telegraph. In this video, we will discuss telephone, fax and email. Let's discuss terms now. First, telephone. Means of communication through which we can talk at far places. Next, fax machine. A machine or device we use to send written documents. Next, telefax. The transmission of documents by fax. Next, internet. Network of networks is called internet. Last one, email. A way of sending an electronic message or data from one computer to another. Now students, open page number 95 of your book and see the point telephone. So first, what is telephone? As I have already told you, telephone is means of communication through which we can talk at far places. Telephone has made communication much easier and simpler. Earlier, there were so many means of communication like cave painting. Near about 5000 years back, man began to record his thoughts, ideas and views in clay tablets, palm leaves, etc. Later, messages began to send through Pigeon Post, Pony Express. Pony Express was a mail service delivering messages through Pony. Pony means a small horse. After that, British introduced postal service to the world. Next invention was of telegraph and then Alexander Graham Bell invented telephone. The fastest means of communication is the telephone. Alexander Graham Bell invented it in 1876. It is the fastest means of communication. Now students, underline the words means and invented. The meaning of means here is method and invented means made something new for first time. The fastest means of communication is telephone. Why? Because it takes less time as compared to pigeon post, pony express, postal services, telegraph and so on. After the invention of telephone, one has to just dial a number and he or she can talk to another person through the use of phone. This is a picture of Alexander Graham Bell who invented telephone in 1876. Before moving further, let me tell you some abbreviations related to communication. First is STD, Subscriber Trunk Dialing. STD codes help to make a call within the country. Next is IST, it means International Subscriber Dialing. The another name of IST is IDD, 
which means international direct dialing isd codes help to make a call outside the country next is sms means short message service it is a text messaging service see some std codes all the states and districts have their unique codes take a look to the isd codes all the countries have their unique codes these are the few examples of isd codes next is pcu public call office it is referred to a place in the public area which provides a telephone facility see a picture of pcu next is pin postal index number it is also called zip code or area postal code it helps to find the address pin code contains six digits see this letter where six digits pin code is mentioned that is 695001 next is qms means quick mail service it was a service provided by postal department before the introduction of speed post service it was free service without any extra charge through the telephone we can communicate with people in other cities in india by using std means subscriber trunk dialing and with people outside india by using isd means international subscriber dialing if one has to call within the country then he or she has to dial std code plus particular phone number if one has to call outside the country then he or she has to dial the code of particular country plus phone number telephone is quite easy and quick to use std and isd codes help for reaching telephone to the another person to whom call is made now the mobile phones or the cellular phone has become popular these phones use radio waves to transmit messages and so far not connected by wires students underline the words popular which means liked by many next transmit which means send out this is a picture of mobile phone another names of mobile phone are cellular phone smartphone and cell phone telephone is the fastest means of communication but mobile phone is the popular means of communication it works through radio waves moreover it has no connection with wire but in the case of telephone it has connection with the wires you can see a picture where a boy is using mobile phone it is also easy to carry using these phones short messages means sms can be sent smartphones are even more popular now as we can listen to music by storing music files photos can be taken and emails can be sent and received underline the word received which means to get or accept there are lot of benefits which made mobile phone popular as compared to telephone like it has no connection with wire which we have already discussed sms can be sent we can listen music by storing files photos can be taken emails can be sent and received it works as a mini computer and mini laptop moreover it has calendar calculator radio and so on next is fax or facsimile fax is a machine or device we use to send written documents a fax works through a telephone line a telefax machine sends a copy of a document containing written or printed matters or pictures instantly now students underline the word document which means an official piece of writing which gives us information next is instantly means immediately 
This is a picture of fax machine. You can see a telephone line is attached with it. A fax machine is designed to send and receive documents. It has both sending and receiving parts. How to send fax through fax machine? First of all, on the machine, place the document you want to send in the fax machine. Enter the fax number of the person to whom you want to send the fax and then press send. After this, wait for the fax machine to finish scanning and sending your document. Next point is email. A way of sending an electronic message or data from one computer to another. Email or electronic mail can be sent to any part of the world using a computer with internet connection. This is much in use now as it delivers messages immediately and is cheaper than the telephone. Now students, underline the words delivers and cheaper. Delivers means bring. Cheaper means lower price. Email means electronic mail. We can send email to any part of the world. We need one computer and that is with internet connection. It is much in use now as it delivers messages immediately and it is cheaper as compared to telephone. www which stands for World Wide Web. It is the part of the internet that contains website etc. It is very important thing in the internet because without it, it is difficult to connect with each other. I hope today's lesson is pretty much clear to you. So now your homework is to solve a exercise given at page number 97, a exercise given at page number 98 and b exercise given at page number 99. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.